Hey everyone, so this video is about the book, You Are Not Your Brain, the four step solution to changing bad habits, ending unhealthy thinking, and taking control of your life, written by Jeffrey Schwartz, who is an MD. And basically, just as the name of this book suggests, it talks about ways to get rid of bad thoughts or negative habits or just things that you don't want in your life. There are things that you're doing that you just want to get rid of. So in this book, there's a four step solution that you can kind of implement and just try to get rid of whatever it is that you want. Now, one thing about this book is that it's just full of stories or success stories of or people who came in with a certain bad habit or just unhealthy thinking that they wanted to get rid of and then through Jeffrey Schwartz's advice and his guidance and counseling they were able to change uh, whatever it is that they wanted to change so throughout the book he constantly goes back to the success stories and he, he'll refer back to them he'll say oh this person did this or this person did that this person did this now personally I, you know, it, for myself, I thought it was a little bit repetitive. Uh, I didn't really enjoy the stories or anecdotes all that much. In the beginning, it was fine. He wanted to make a point, but then after a while, it just got a little bit repetitive. So for that reason, I don't think it's that good of a book. But for yourself, you might enjoy learning through stories or through anecdotes or other things like that and you know that might be a book for you but anyways so let's dive into the four uh, four step solutions so the very first one is called relabel the second step is called reframe the third is called refocus and then the fourth is called revalue so what does that all mean well basically the very first thing is when when you say relabel that's just a fancy word for having an awareness or being able to recognize that you are doing something bad that you don't want to continue happening. So maybe it's the negative thoughts or just a bad habit that you're doing as the book suggests, right? So just having that awareness and being able to say, oh, I'm doing this, I don't really want that. So that's number one. The second is to reframe. So example, if you're having negative thoughts, and you're saying, oh, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm such a bad person for this. So the whole idea of the second step is to just kind of stop, stop. Once you have the awareness, the second step is to stop and then think about something else. So reframing your thoughts. So you want to shift, basically shift your thoughts. And then the third is, which is refocus. You want to focus on more positive things. You want to focus on something that is actually constructive. So if you are saying, I'm so bad at this, uh, I can't do it, then reframe and then refocus on something that is more positive or maybe like, oh, this experience here is very interesting. It's my first time doing it. I'm having a lot of fun, right? So it, it, basically it's just kind of distracting yourself or just getting your getting you to think about something else and then the last thing is the fourth step which is revalue and that's basically saying that you after you've re or done the first three things then you look back at your initial thoughts and say hey you know why why was i thinking about that that's, that's so stupid that's these negative thoughts or bad habits let's get rid of it they are not very healthy to my health or they're not very good for my health and so I'm just gonna get rid of it and so yeah that's the four step solution to getting rid of your bad habits or changing your negative thoughts or just getting rid of those thoughts but yeah anyways I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up or hit that subscribe button if you are interested in uh, getting notifications of my future videos if you're interested in the book there's a link down below Check out my website at www.bookstakeaway.com for other books that I've reviewed. And yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you again in the next video. Bye for now.